Woman's Intuition is the 22nd episode of the second season of the Doris Day Show. And this one's directed by Denver Pyle, which is quite nice because he's not actually in it. Buck and the kids are not in this one. In fact, very few of the regulars are in this one. And in a way, I don't mind because we have a different environment. But I will say I preferred the first half of the episode to the second half. And this is all about something pretty dramatic that happens while Doris is on a plane. Mr. Nicholson's going to Florida for an important interview and he's taking Doris along. Doris is very excited because she's never been to Florida before. And the first half of the episode, give or take, I didn't time it exactly, but roughly the first half is them on the plane. And it's quite comical. The air stewardess is causing all kinds of problems. Nothing major, but just lots of small little things. And it, it's pretty funny and it's pretty relaxed. And I enjoyed the aeroplane setting. I thought that worked really well. Now, that's not to say I didn't like the second half, but it definitely shifts in tone, which in theory is a good thing. It shows narrative development, but it didn't shift to something I personally found that interesting because something happens with a passenger who causes some problems. You can probably imagine the kind of thing I'm talking about, but I won't spoil it too much. And it's all about how this person interacts mostly with Doris. And it took a direction I absolutely wasn't expecting. And I feel like we should have spent more time on the plane because we do leave the plane at one point. And I feel like I just, I like that setting so much. And maybe they were thinking, okay, it's a small space. People are going to become bored of it. So let's move away from the aircraft. I can kind of understand if that was their thinking. But personally, I, I didn't love the direction it took. I think it would have actually been better if it played out on the aircraft and was maybe a little bit more intense. I, I don't know. I feel like I'm asking it to be not a comedy, but to become quite a drama, which is obviously not what the show's intending. But just for me personally, I think that's something I would have preferred. But as I said, it isn't the case that I didn't like the second half. It's just for me, if I were to give this a star rating, which I, I never do with Doris Day, the first half would get a much higher rating than the second half. The intuition aspect is because Doris keeps having, well, these intuitions that something bad is going to happen. And Miss Rome Nicholson sometimes listens to her, sometimes doesn't. And, well, things play out accordingly. It's a good episode, even though Toby, Billy and Buck weren't in it, uh, or Myrna. Uh, it, it was still good. I still enjoyed it. Definitely a lot of fun, more so in the first half. But it was still a well-constructed narrative. It wasn't too bad at all. Uh, and ultimately, I'm sure it's one I'll always enjoy.